Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. So guys, until now we have learned Python completely from basic to advanced level. Even that all those videos are available in the Python playlist which is available in channel. You can check out in this particular playlist. So you can see here the Python playlist is available. In this we have everything including the roadmap and everything you can check out that particular videos to know about Python. And even we have learned about the virtual machine MongoDB you can check out all this. So guys in today's video we are going to do a mini project using Python. Sounds a bit interesting right. So today we will be implementing a basic mini project using Python. Because only learning loops or else a list triple dictionary it doesn't help you all. You should be able to do the projects also. So slowly we will start one by one. Today we will be doing a very basic mini project. It is not that advanced also. It is just a medium level project. So the agenda of today's video will be to do a encryption and decryption of a PDF file. So this is the project. You can ask me what is the use of this particular project mini project. And what is the use of encrypting a PDF file and decrypting? There is no big information in that. Why do you want to do that? So <coughs> if you have downloaded your Aadhaar card soft copy, I am telling you all. So if you have downloaded your soft copy of Aadhaar card, if you are an Indian citizen, you will get it. So when you try to open it, you will be seeing that it will be asking you for a password. So if you give the password according to the instructions given in that particular mail, only then it will be opened or else no. Why they are giving you all that particular encryption method, password and everything to that one PDF file? Because there is some sensitive information in your Aadhaar card which except you no one else should get to know about that particular information. So only they have given you the encryption method and everything. So the same way we are going to do this PDF encrypting and decrypting. The main use of this will be that you can share some passwords and even you can share some sensitive information if you want to send to someone you can just encrypt that with a password to that particular PDF file and you can send to them and you can personally tell them the password so that no one else will get to know if they open your mail or else if some other uh, person try to access your uh, system and if they open the PDF file it will be secured without the password no one can access that so guys now let us dive into our VS code and discuss more about that so to implement this particular project we require one library called pypdf2 this will help you in reading the particular pdf files and <coughs> performing the operations so today we will be encrypting this one particular pdf uh, file which uh, was available in my laptop so actually this is uh, this pdf file i'll show you all afterwards when it is encrypted now i'll not show you all it is the same pdf file so what we will be doing in this particular code is before that you have to install this library if you, it is not available in your system you should install it for that just go to terminal open new terminal <coughs> and type here pip install capital pi pdf2 and wait for a minute it will be installed so if you have already installed then it will show you all that the requirement is already satisfied. So now let us check the code. I can try write and show you all the code but if I write and show you all the code it will take more time which is uh, like simply waste of time. So I have already written the code. I will be just go uh, going through the code. I will just detail explain you all and even I have written there with the hashtag you can check out that particular lines also these all are nothing but i have explained each and every line of code with this hash comment you can check out that and if you read that you will easily understand when you try to implement you will get it i will be giving you all this particular uh, python file in the link will be in this description you can download it easily in this video description now let us start the project so this particular importing pi pdf2 we have to type this we have installed this so we can directly import that now our task will be to write a def function def lock pdf and we have given the parameters input path output path and password and now open the pdf file to open that particular pdf file we are writing the code with open input path 
read binary rb means read binary as input file hmm. create a pdf reader object now it's time to create a pdf reader object pdf reader is equals to py pdf2 dot pdf reader and input file so it is nothing but to read that particular pdf file we have taken py pdf2 library dot pdf reader to read that particular pdf and it is read now now create a pdf writer object pdf writer is equals to py pdf2 dot pdf writer so when we have read that then why did you give the writer object also i'll just explain you further about that so now it's time to loop each and every pages in that particular pdf and we have to write that object for that only we have imported pdf writer so each and every object or else each and every page in that <coughs> pages in that particular pdf file should be written in some other another pdf file i'll tell you about that for page number we have created a variable page number in range and length of pdf reader dot pages so we have taken pdf reader dot pages now pdf writer dot add pages pdf reader dot pages and page number so it's nothing but whatever this particular pdf file ha is having that pages it is telling to just read that pages and write it in another uh, this one pdf write it in add pages option i mean in another pdf file which we are going to create <coughs> now encrypt the pdf file with a password so pre pdf writer dot encrypt password so with this variable we have written that particular all the pages we have added right now we are encrypting that with the password nothing else apart from that now write the encrypted pdf in the output file for that what we have done with open output path write binary wb means write binary as output file pdf writer dot write output file output underscore file this is nothing but we are creating an object called output underscore file so it will be created encrypt uh, storing the encrypted file there now def unlock pdf so when we lock the pdf that is nothing but encryption now we have to even decrypt the pdf right so this code is for decrypting let me just go through this also then i'll just show you all with a practical example def unlock pdf input path output path and password it is same now open the pdf file with open input path read binary as input file now create a pdf reader object same we will be creating a pdf reader object as input file check if the pdf file is encrypted so this is changed here now we will be checking if that particular pdf file is encrypted or not for that what we will do if pdf reader dot is encrypted now try to decrypt the pdf reader with the password pdf reader dot decrypt password so here also if we provide the pdf reader a password whatever password we have entered if we provide that here only it will be decrypted or else no so it is decrypted now we will be saying that create a pdf reader object <coughs> pdf uh, sorry pdf writer object pdf writer is equals to pdf2 dot pdf writer so we have uh, created a pdf writer object with that now loop through the pages whichever is available in that particular writer object same for page number in same there is no changes in the code whichever i have explained you further length and pdf uh, pdf reader dot pages and page numbers the same code which we have explained in the writer encryption the same code is here and now write the unlock pdf to the output file now with open output path write binary as output file and pdf writer dot write output file here it's nothing but here what we have done at the up we have just read the file we have encrypted that particular file and we have saved that to output path here we have read the file we have decrypted that particular file with the password and we have saved that to output file uh, output path that's all now getting my point so now let us practically try to do that and see now let me just uncomment this also so this is output unlocked pdf so output locked pdf here now let us run the code so i have already saved the path so this will this particular file path i have copied and i have updated that particular path here 
and I have given it name as output logged PDF and I have given the password as 12345 just a basic password now let us just run this particular code as soon as I run the code you can see here it's done and it is it has created output logged file and output unlocked PDF file so now let us just open the <coughs> particular file path and let us see So it is stored here only let me just open output logged file so guys you can see here it is asking me for the password now if I enter a wrong password something randomly if I enter and give so it is telling you to check the password because it is encrypted you cannot open this without that particular password so our writer object is successful now let me just give it and the password whichever I have written so one two three four five now open the file so you can just see this that particular PDF file is opened it's just an uh, some random link which uh, PDF file which I got so just I took that only so you can see here it got opened now if I close this and if I open that unlocked PDF it is already decrypted so you don't need to enter password for this it will directly get opened you can see here this is nothing but a normal file which you have given there is no uh, there is no much use of this but it will be helpful for you all to decrypt it easily for example for suppose now the uh, writer is already done so it is already saved in the let me just uh, comment this particular line so already output file uh, logged file is available now let me just comment this particular file pdf and let me just give it a wrong password right now now let me run this code and see see it is giving you file has not been decrypted so if you enter the wrong password it will not get decrypted but it will be useful for you all to remove the password from that particular pdf file for that this decryption code will be useful so I am giving you all this code also you can use both of this it is not that big project also and not that complex project also very basic project so guys that's all for today's video do like share and subscribe the channel and guys there is a big announcement for you all from now onwards I will be starting the interview series also I will be teaching you all the python coding interview related questions which will be very important for your interview so that's all guys do like share and subscribe the channel thank you all bye bye